In the 15 for my bros, yeah. 15 with my bros, yeah. Lagos, I wanna come home. Lagos, I wanna come home. Show my love. Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Zara Beauty in the yeah yeah and I'm back. <laughs> oh baby I'm back. Hello. Hello. Hi. I am back with another video ho, okay. Today's video is gonna be a whole video and it's going to be from a company I've worked with before and that is lovelyhosale.com. I just decided to start off this video, you know, with the pieces because I just came back from taking bum ass, fire ass pics and y'all know that I'm gonna disturb the tea, y'all, period. All the links to all the outfits will be in the description box below as well as a code okay to save you some money so that we can slay okay all right so this is the first outfit this is the top so the outfit is the top let me show you guys fully what it looks like when it's not tucked into this pants so this is what it looks like it's like an actual corset top like it's it's really really cool like this is an actual corset like i know you guys can see it Yes, my underwear is showing because this this tights are sheer AF, but like it's an actual corset. Like this shit cinches. Like it's literally cinching me right now. Um, let's talk about the make of the outfit. It's actually solid. So literally they took a corset, added a place for a bra, and added this. Just tacked it in here. That's literally all they did to this outfit because it's solid AF. Like this is definitely one of the best quality pieces I've ever received from Lovely Wholesale because it is sturdy. It is sturdy. Now I got this in a size small. So my hands are really big, a little bit bigger because I do work out. So I have biceps and triceps big. So I find that it's a bit tight on my bicep area. Like, can y'all see that? Mm-hmm, yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> I'm not really sure for all my full breasted ladies if this will work out for you because I don't have that much of boobs, but it does push. I'm gonna tell y'all now, it does push. It does give you the illusion of bigger breasts. It does sell you the dreams, baby but um, there's not a lot of breast space um, so that's something I noticed but maybe the bigger you go um, the more breast space is available but this is just perfect for my boob size like you don't see that huge gap you know when it's not your size you see the huge gap like it's perfect like it's a slay on uh, say look this is Zara certified Zara verified because this shit is just giving me all sorts of vibe right now I'm feeling like I want to wear this for Halloween like what do you guys think of this let me know what you think in the comment section below so lest I forget this outfit also came with this uh, thong thingy in the packaging and I only realized it like later when I was like clearing out the packaging that it was there I'm not sure what it is I don't see myself wearing the thong with the corset top because it's kind of awkward but yeah I just wanted to let you guys know that this is a complete set of a thong and a corset shirt but let me know what you guys think of the entire outfit in the comment section below okay y'all um, this is the other outfit now usually y'all know I like to wear my waist trainer my um, compression garment to give me that ultra cinched extra extra look but today I said it to just go natural so you guys can see what it looks like you know with the curves and everything yeah, I don't mind this, please. This was I was wearing the barrette all fucking day. So yes, I have a whole line of demarcation on my head. It's okay. So imagine you're in your mother-in-law's house and you're telling her, you know, you're trying to show her that uh, wifey material. So you come out looking like Maria Maka. Your dress is reaching you. Oh, they still used to do secondary school. Two fingers below the knee. <laughs> and you're like, good afternoon, ma. Yes, ma. Then. After I finish this, then her and Bae is like, I got a surprise for you. <laughs> and you just, boom! <laughs> hey, boo. <laughs> What's up? Jekalo Pari. Let's go to Pari. And you guys already know that yellow is chocolate. It's for chocolate. That's our color. We were made to wear vibrant colors like this. So I can just already imagine, like, what do you mean? One of the few times that these Chinese wholesale companies actually get the material and the look 
like they're going for and let me give you a tip when you're buying from these discount fast fast fashion stores always look at the material most people do not look at the material do not judge by the picture most of them steal these pictures from other sites like they say it's polyester and the the picture right there is looking like cotton do not buy it because you are going to get polyester okay so i knew this was a polyester fashion dress like this was a polyester dress so when i had seen the um the description that says it was made from polyester i knew that it was going to look like this so that's a tip that you should take if you're looking for a discount fast fashion but yeah i really like this let's start with the fact that this stuff is everywhere like it's so cheaply made it is so sheer i'm pretty sure my entire life is it's just on the screen because what is this like a for effort but like honestly this is just it's everywhere like this the white stuff is everywhere like it's just around my house right now i thought this was gonna be a cute flirty set i mean that's what it's meant to be you know like a nice pajama set you know when you're going for your da which is aka dick appointment you know you just wear this like really comfy you're not doing too much but you're also doing too much a little bit that's kind of like what this is meant to be, but this is poor construction. The real thing, the real draw was in the fluffy stuff, which they couldn't even get right. Like it's so thin, it's so sheer. You can see the lines, you can see the knitting. Like, this is so cheap, y'all. This is just not it. I might just take a couple pictures with this, you know, pose a little. Like this really cute gray slide that I think would just look so cute. Like this is great for like a pajama party or like, you know, you're going out sleepover with the girls or something. It's really, really cute. However, I'm just not impressed by the make and the fact that like this stuff is just all over the place. This is not gonna last long in your closet. So just be mindful of that. It does the job. If you're not looking for something too fancy, you're not trying to spend 50, 60, 100 dollars on a set from Pretty Little Thing or Fashion Nova, then this is the one for you. Regina George reporting live. Clueless bitch. Hello. Hello. I like the concept of this outfit. Like, I actually like the concept i could see where they were going with this however again we have a problem of poor execution but that is why they are a discount fast fashion store so i think this is one of like shane Justin designs or jisoo Wu, one of those like you know instagram like designers and this was of course copied from them nothing is new under the sun anymore so I mean, I like this vibe, it is pretty. I definitely see myself like maybe rocking this with a short hair to a pixie cut or maybe like a bob, really pretty makeup. And it's just like, <laughs> hi. This is not meant to be polyester. The actual design on the outfit is meant to be cotton. So it's meant to be cotton. This is meant to be a cotton dress. And I, I like, yeah. This is a ripoff. They use polyester, but it's still not so bad. Like you can still work with this. So I like it. I actually do fuck with this outfit, y'all. Um, and this is definitely something I can rock here and there, but it's so cheaply made that you can clearly see that this was the design they were going for and this is not how it was ex executed. However, I'm the kind of person I believe that as long as you rock something really well, nobody needs to know. Nobody often know to get got it from Chinatown. Nobody often know nothing, nothing at all, you know. The skirt cut and the top cut is nice. However, this whole thing going on here it's i'm pretty sure this is not how it was meant to look like but i mean it is what it is sis. but this is the outfit guys let me know what you think about this one in the comment section okay y'all so this is another outfit just the pants so i had worn this pants on my instagram one of these days and you guys were going crazy asking me where i got my pants from i also posted a picture on insta wearing these pants and 
yeah, I love them. I do love them as well. Even though like when I was picking them, I was like, girl, where are you gonna wear this shit to? But it actually really is a nice pair of pants. Nice fitting. And I love the tassels, I really do. Like they're really cool. So it's like distressed jeans needs tassels. Like I love them. What do you guys think of the jeans? I feel like they can go with a variety of outfits. They're just like that extra pop you need to like a very casual outfit. Maybe if you're not sure um, if you want to go like extra, if you want to go like dress down, and you just put this on. Um, but my waist is a bit smaller than my hips so i always have that problem of trying to fit into my pants but other than that this is like a really 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 nice pair of pants what do you guys think of this in the comment section below let me know y'all i really really like this pants one of my best the fitting is just perfect like they got it right and this is a size small y'all I am impressed. No waist trainer, no nothing. Like imagine once I get snatchity snatch, girl, this outfit would be a fucking banger with my Body by Zara compression garment and Body by Zara waist trainer, girl. No, this is one of the few outfits that Lovely Hostel got the fitting perfect. Like this is like a perfect cut. And you guys I actually spent 15 minutes lacing this shit up just so you guys can see what it actually looks like. So y'all should give me my props. Give me a like for the lace up plex at my life. This is something you can dress up and dress down. Just throw in a pair of slipper heels and you know, a really nice necklace, your hair in the updo, and just a very casual but cute look for. You can wear a big ass jacket, wear some boots, get some dark smoky makeup and you're really dressed up the look like this is just that perfect in between dress you need a dress for summer i got you you need a dress for autumn fall i got you this is just an all year round type of dress and i really really fuck with this you can wear it to the club and you can wear it to church girl just throw on a pair of heels <laughs> a big jacket long ass heels a hat and you're church ready like this is just this dress can go for like a lot of occasions and i really like the corset design you know the lace design because it really does cinch you a little bit more this is just really well done i really like this y'all should definitely cup this if you don't want to cut anything out of this entire haul this one is worth it girl mm -hmm. what is this you guys got it right with the first one this is what it's meant to look like look at this it's meant to be fitted then loose but no this person did Baggy, they fit. Why? Why are you a hater? You are an EP, enemy of progress. The tailor that got this dress, you are an enemy of progress. Because this is a cute dress. Like, what are you saying? Like, it won't come to the whole drawstring thingy, too. Right there. Right? And I'm just like, is it that I'm not drawing it away or something? The person that got this dress, you are nothing but a hater. Look at this. Like, why is it baggy here? And then fitted here. And this is not how it's meant to be. Look at how it looks like on the model. It's meant to be fitted. It's meant to give you a shape. This is a sadistic cut. Sadistic. I mean, it doesn't look too bad. I'm sure you guys are looking at it like, ah, Zara, calm down. It's not that bad. But no, no, no. I had high hopes. I had high hopes for this dress. So I'm hot inside. This should have been top three. But this is where it is right now. I mean, looking at it now, y'all, it doesn't look too, too bad. But like, I'm definitely have to touch, I'm definitely gonna have to touch it up a little bit. Not even gonna lie, getting into this dress was a struggle because this is a size small, and I think maybe I should have gone for medium. But imagine if I had gone for medium, well, my shape would be his like it's like pure water inside that shit. You understand? Look, even this vibe, like this vibe is it's a vibe. It's a vibe now. This cut is so embarrassing. I'm so embarrassed. Whoever cuts this cloth, you have to go back to Taylor School. You have to go back because this is not it. I mean, I can still finesse it. Maybe I'll just get a little gold belt here. Just use it to cinch this place. Love the arms. What really drew me to this are the arms. Not gonna lie, the cut is bad, but the stitching is actually pretty decent. And it's actually denim. Like it's not that, um, 
like leggings material because a lot of fast fashion brands use leggings material instead of like real denim so it's actually denim and i actually do like the frayed edges a little bit it does give it this kind of rustic vibe the only annoying thing is this cut and then your progress pillow but other than that i think i can finesse it y'all i can definitely finesse it what do you guys think let me know in the comment section Okay, so I'm gonna show you guys one of the stuff I got. However, I tried putting it on, girl. I spent 25 minutes trying to wear this shit and it just did not work out because it was too small for me. And it's crazy because all their jean sizes come in different measurements. So all the other jeans I got, like all the other denim I got, like they fit me perfectly. But for some reason, this one does not have as much elasticity. But this is what it looks like. It's like a patchwork. I just liked it because it just looked like it would be really cool for Instagram if you style it well, like, you know, with a really nice jacket or just all denim everything and with some boots. So I really, I'm really, really mad. This could not even go past my thighs. Like, it did not even go past, like, the top part of my thighs. It was like, nope, nope, mm-mm, uh-uh, that's it. <laughs> I can look at it. Maybe you guys can see the stitching. It's pretty decent. Where they patched it, I mean, I would have loved if it was a tie and dye as opposed to like an actual stitch. Like this is actually two materials in one. I would have appreciated it a little bit more if it was a tie and dye. Do you know what I mean? If you just faded into this material, you know, if it was like this, like blue, and then there was a slight fade, and then we have like this darker blue. I would have really, really liked it. I think it would have been cooler. But this patchwork is also not bad. I think it also gives it its own like rustic vibes. It actually has like functional pockets. It doesn't have those fake pockets. A lot of them don't have fake, like a lot of them have fake pockets. And then Fashion Nova came with no pockets at all. So I do actually appreciate that it has both front and back pockets. So it's pretty sturdy i mean like i said it's not the best material it's not like levi denims or like gap denims but this is like a decent denim you know like fast fashion denim it's just a little bit lighter it is like pretty thin but it's not so thin that it's unwearable and it rips at the slightest touch so that is something i definitely appreciate it's still pretty decent i'll wear it Okay, y'all, so last and certainly least, girl, yes, last and least of all is this dress. Lovely wholesale. If y'all didn't even want to make this dress, y'all should have just said it. If, like, what is this? This material is so light, you can probably see the blood running through my veins. What is this? Y'all. Yeah. Okay, so this is, this is what it was meant to look like. Look at that. Take a look at that. Does it look like this? I look like a sexy nurse. I look like I'm about to put an IV up somebody's arm. What is this? Lovely, baby, see. If you didn't want to make the dress, you could have just said so. If you didn't want to use material, you could have just said so. Because what kind of stingy shit is this? What is this shit? I mean, it's fitted. Let's give it that it's fitted, but I feel like if I breathe, the material will tear. Like I feel like if I literally, you're gonna, it's gonna rip. It becomes a little bit more rouge, right? Like around here. I honestly wish that the denim I'm dressed had the same type of like rouge effect that this one has, because this is just wasted on this one. Like I feel like this, the whole like, drawstring is wasted on this outfit because this is literally trash what is this like lovely wholesale is a hit or miss you either get a really nice outfit like my corset dress or like the bandage dress i got or you get this and you look like a nurse the rest of the day anyway guys we are done with the video thank you jesus finally we are done with the haul these were all the items that i received from lovely wholesale remember to use my code 10 if you want to buy anything from them um 
let me know if you guys like these hauls you want to see more stuff anyway guys thank you so much for tuning in with me today if you are new to my channel make sure you hit that also make sure you thumbs up this video for more videos like these and also if you just want to see my pretty face because <laughs> anyway guys thank you so much for tuning in with me today and i will see you in my next video au revoir bye